The Zacuto EVF stands out from any other professional viewfinder in many ways, one of which is its ability to scale your viewable image in the viewfinder to any desired size and position. The Zacuto EVF's factory scaling default is its auto setting. Within the scaling menu, you will find the auto option. By highlighting and selecting it, the EVF will show you everything that the camera's LCD would naturally show, scaling the image to make sure that the entire recordable area and any included camera settings fit. One feature that sets the Zacuto EVF apart from the rest are its specific scaling presets. Within the scaling menu of the EVF, you will find the menu labeled Camera Presets, which contains precise pre-scaled sizes already programmed for over a dozen cameras. These sizes are set to fill the maximum space of the EVF monitor with the image that your particular camera will record both when the camera is in standby mode and when recording. Just highlight the camera you'd like to use within the menu and hit the select button to choose the preset. The Zacuto EVF also allows total manual control over what, where, and how you'd like to see what it has to show you. Before any manual adjusting, we recommend that you always auto scale the image first. Under the scaling menu, you'll find the manual menu Within this menu, the EVF offers every adjustable option you'd need to set your image the exact way you'd like. Scale up and scale down increases and decreases the size of the viewable image in the EVF. Position left, right, up, and down moves the entirety of the image all around the screen. And position center brings the image back to the direct center of the EVF screen. Once you've completed all the manual adjustments to your image that you'd like to make, the Zacuto EVF offers four savable preset slots to store your settings. This allows you to recall them at any time with the press of a button. After adjustment, near the bottom of the manual menu, you will see the Save button. When highlighted and selected, the four options of savable preset slots will appear. Highlight your desired slot and select it. You can now find those scaling settings at any time in the scaling menu under Camera Presets. At the bottom of the page, you will see your four preset options available for selection. Another manual scaling feature is the Lock Frame Line option. This option automatically scales any frame line you've turned on, ensuring it is accurate to however you've resized and spaced the image it is framing. The best way to do this is to first turn on the outline of the aspect ratio that you are using and desired frame lines. These can be found in the main menu under Frame Line. Next, auto scale your image, as you always should before any manual manipulation. Once auto scaled, manually enlarge the recordable image so that it fits into the aspect ratio outline you've turned on. You may now select the Lock Frame Line option allowing you to manually scale your image to your desired setting while keeping the frame line accurate to any adjustment made. Also, if you decide to lock frame lines and you save your scaled image as a preset, the EVF will allow you to switch between frame lines without losing your adjusted frame line size. Lastly, the Zacuto EVF allows you to underscan your image. Underscanning creates a layer of black pixels around your recordable image, making the edges better visible. This is especially helpful when dealing with video and GH2 cameras, which lack the ability to be scaled down. Within the scaling menu, you'll find the Underscan menu. The Zacuto EVF gives you the option to choose how many pixels you'd like to underscan your image, as well as an on and off switch for fast-paced workflows. All of these options and more are available for use with the EVF right now, ready to help keep your shoot precise and efficient. And be on the lookout for even more helpful features included in our frequent, free firmware updates.